And let's get back in. Uh, so I didn't get through... Let me move my mouse so that stops doing things. I didn't get through all of the uh, um, Point Nemo missions. Um, so I'm not going to... We're not going to be uh, doing that this time. Um, also, Ellie was getting over-leveled. I say that when, you know, Ellie is clearly not already over-leveled, right? Uh, do, do, do. I'm gonna find you in here. Where are you, Ellie? Oh, I suppose I could just go by level, can't I? Yeah, so she's up to one level 185. Priscilla is 174. Um, and that's just because she keeps getting the kills on on that guy, and it's uh. You know, I, I should probably... probably wait. And who exactly made Ellie that overleveled and overpowered? Oh, I'm pretty sure it was the, uh, um, the optional super boss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Definitely that. Uh, let's see. Power parts. Uh, I do have a few. I didn't get them all equipped. We got, uh... So we've been getting some of these from those uh, fights. Long range impact, uh, plus 10% damage to units seven plus spaces away. Uh, full coat armor, nullifies weapon effects like armor down. Eh. Zone recover, meh. Extra arms X, the power of the unit's strongest weapon becomes 8,000 unless it already has a stronger attack. Uh, plus 300 close quarters battle and plus one move. And this seems to be a base thing um, because I noticed on one of the suits that I put it on that it was affecting something that shouldn't have been affected anyway. Uh, Fairy's Grace, uh, plus 20 max SP, plus 10 max morale, plus 10 starting morale. Uh, assault Adapter, plus 200 weapon attack, A ranks in all things. Archeonis Wing, plus 3 move. Uh, command Terminal, Commander L4. An another AOS, AOS Arc, uh, plus 200 weapon attack, plus 20 mobility, minus 10% weapon energy cost. And Sword of Aus, activates the Valor Spirit on all allies. Which is pretty good. But uh, for now, we're not going to be equipping any of those. Right, blame the uh, optional super boss. Oh yeah, I will. I will. I definitely will. Uh, let's see, upgrades. AOS update. Uh, so I can get another one. Um, Uh, let's see. So that's plus two move and plus 200 close quarters battle. Oops. Uh, so I think we'll get another one of those. And you get like 8,000 MXP for that fight as well. So I'll be getting a lot more of some of these parts. Uh, skill program. I got 9,000 points. So we'll be getting some more skills eventually as well. Uh, upgrades. How much money do I have? I have a lot of money, so let's go ahead and get some more upgrades. All right, let's look for things that we will probably still need to use. Ray Earth. Uh, we'll go with mobility. Uh, we do have you guys, but I'm going to wait on you. Rock High Loom I use. So let's give Bright a uh, pretty big, nice upgrade. Uh, range up. And... Yeah, I don't know. I guess just terrain adaptivity, whatever. Okay, uh, who else have we definitely not finished using yet? Uh, 
Let me go see what we have uh, mission-wise to do. Um, so we've got Heaven and World, we've got uh, Dreamers Forever, and a, a Surging Scourge. I think we'll probably do a Surging Scourge, so let's go ahead and get an upgrade to a... One of you. One of those. Although, have I upgraded... Uh, Ikaruga. What the heck is Ikaruga? The DLC for the rabbits comes late. Yeah. Well, it doesn't it come? A I mean, it seems to to be after the uh, thing. Okay, Ikaruga is uh, upgraded. All right. Um. I guess I'll give it to Zendog. Just do one level. There we go. Uh, mobility up. There we go. One thing you find amusing is Bright should be the commander of this unit since he does outrank uh, Mitzvah. Yeah, but Commodore Fike said no, and um, uh, he agreed with it as well, so. <laughs> All right, uh, and onboard missions, we got none. So, a Surging Scourge. Uh, moving to the mission point Z08 Debris Sector. Yep. A new Volgaru threat. Team Rabbits faces a new Wolgaru threat. Dreistrager Messall. Ah! Keep drawing, Azuru. Draw until your fingers fall off. Practice as the fuel of, in your rocket to start them. Yes, sir, Daisuke, sir. My entire being is focused on, in the point of this pen. Wow, Azuru's been drawing like crazy. Why can't he just enjoy his break? My muse never rests, not when I'm surrounded by all the heroes of the Hamtopia. The war with the Volgaru is over, but Azuru is still the same old Azuru. If anything, his passion for creating manga has only grown more intense. You bet it has. After all, I'm surrounded by inspiration in the form of all my friends. The heroic giant who aids us from another world through a computer. Uh, the Castle of Iron, the one who can be a be God or devil passed down from a grandfather in order to fight evil with justice, love, and friendship. <laughs> you forgot Teoria joined the ship. She joined quite a while ago, actually. She's been with us for a while. She just hasn't had much to say. Uh, hang on. The amateur machinist who grew into an ace, ace through the fires of war and holds the potential to evolve humanity. That's a little much. The boy and his robot friends who've sworn to uphold law and order and fight crime whenever, wherever it lurks. Ah, oh, come on. All these heroes and more, that's what pushes me on. Not enough to improve your art, though. He tried making a character based on Daba, and he somehow, someway, discovered the exact pen strokes needed to make him ugly. <laughs> and the female characters just look weird somehow. And it's not for a lack of good models. If you're not having much luck with models, why not model one based on yourself? Me? You were a failure, but you've become an ace. That's a, there's a compelling story in there. You fought a Wolgaru ace to a standstill, then seized victory. That's plenty for a hero. Thanks, Lieutenant Amaro, but that's definitely going too far. Oh boy, self-insert manga. Oh yeah. Yeah, not to downplay that battle or anything, but it was kind of a fluke. It just about evens out all the flailing around he normally does. Not even. He's still in the negatives. I've run the numbers, and he's still in the red by a considerable margin. Just when I thought I was free of the dog piles. 
Oh, Azuru, you know you're never going to be free of those. Uh, have we seen Randy in civilian clothes before? You need to keep growing if you want your teammates to follow you. Wagaru well, remnant activity has been on the rise lately. Rise of late. And, uh, Chandra? Please, for the love of God, do not ever wear a tie with a vest like that. Get some sleeves, please. Oh my god. What the hell? The Hamtopia will be deployed to handle it. There's your chance to rack up some points. You think it came up once or twice, but you don't think you've seen Chandra's? I'm 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 sure we have not seen Chandra or Patrick. I don't recall uh Randy at all. I I, I mean of the three of them, Patrick has the best uh, style sense, clearly. enemy attack. I mean, all of them have some very odd clothing choices. Enemies in this area. K... I kind of feel like least of all. <laughs> Does that mean... Like, what the heck is up with Saruga? It, it's like he's wearing pants up around his neck. Like, there's a... That looks like a belt, but it's a wrap as well. What is wrong with a sleeveless business suit? The fact that it's sleeveless. The future leads to weird fashion. Which is kind of funny because I think we've kind of seen already over the past, uh, um, how many decades that men's fashion doesn't actually change that much? <laughs> yeah, it's gotta. Tomiki's outfit is cute. Wogaru. Azuru kind of looks like a... Except for the collar, which is way too big. It's, it's okay. You blame that one dandy who dressed for hours? Special scenario, a surging scourge. Look, I mean, if they want surge soda, they can just have it all. It's a poor man's Mountain Dew anyways. Dreis Traeger and Godinian and Red 5. And we have one other ship. Uh, we will go ahead and bring the uh, Reinforced Junior because it needs levels more. It almost looks like an anime version of Michael Jackson. Hmm. I will admit to have not seen Michael Jackson's uh, uh, outfits that often. All right, Rose three, uh, black six, gold four, blue one, purple two, Rhinos, MP New Gundam, Celise Wyndham. All right, so we got two left. Um, Lowest level actual story characters are Shiro and Quattro, but I don't think they have stories left. Um, Grid Knight does. Eagle does. So I guess we could bring out one of them. Kind of trying to think of who might benefit the most. We're getting some levels. And Grid Knight will definitely bring out uh, in like the next Gridman mission because there aren't that many Gridman units. Um, Hikaru should probably get some levels. There we go. Dang, Azuru's got a brick in, on the accelerator. I gotta show everyone I've grown and prove I'm a hero. Attaboy, Azuru. Keep following in my footsteps. 
Since when are you a veteran hero? Just let him have this. Stay alert, everyone. We've got a large force headed our way. There they are. Aw, they're all mixed colors. Isn't that nice? The Wogaru. Additional forces are approaching adjacent sectors. It appears that they are mobilizing all the remaining forces in the solar system to enter Earth's atmosphere. They've been thrown into squads almost at random. Who's commanding them? All units, intercept the Wolgaru. Don't let them pass you, no matter what. Good luck, Azuru. I hope this gets you closer to being a hero. Thanks, I'll give it my all. Alright, defeat all enemies. Allied warship shot down. Azuru shot down. Wolgaru mobile weapons have minor differences from one another, from one squad to another. Check the stat screen for them. Mmm. Candy coated Wolgaru. Mm mmm. My, my, my. Alright, so the green ones. The green ship has the most hit points. Yeah, the green units have the most hit points, too, by a thousand. Alright, let's start off with some X-Actions. Okay. Don't have any uh, parts. You have the uh, X counter mega booster. There we go. Boost X counter. Boost X counter. Boost X counter. There we go. Go ahead and Vital Damper. Alright, get a Resolve going. Okay, who needs uh, X Counter? You do. You do. Gonna go ahead and uh, try boosting everyone up. There's another resolve. There's another resolve. So I can't do too many more of these. Uh, and it looks like I've gotten everyone uh, up once I do window. All right, there we go. All right, multi-action. 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 Hey, if you got uh, uh, Transformers in there, you could also have even more uh, Super Trains. Astro Train. There was a black steam locomotive on the Autobot side, but I can't remember what uh, his, what he, he was called. At least I think so. I suppose it could be misremembering with GoBots. 
I might be misremembering with GoBots. Some of the little ones, uh, um, some of the little ones uh, can be uh, confusing. And those knockoff Thomas the Tank Engine Transformers. <laughs> Okay, so, let's see, we've got uh, X-Counter on everyone, uh, let's see, the people with fortune. Okay. Uh, also, Tekadan's Way. I think the Black Locomotive might have been a, a Takara Tomy one, but not an official Transformers. I uh, would it have been released here in the U.S. then? Because either I had it or my neighbor had it. It was one of the little it, like it was it was more uh, size scaled to uh, like Bumblebee than um, uh, some of the bigger Transformers. Right, I forgot to uh, change uh, animation. I will do that in a second. You turn that back on. Go ahead and charge. We can charge you. Get animations back on. And get a cheer. Yeah, but I mean, it was it was like that scale of toy, as opposed to like Wheeljack or Ironhide. And I think there was a, a combiner, one of the Gestalt ones, was trains. think? I don't know that it showed up in the uh, TV series. <laughs> Tomki's so cute. Nyerom. Nyerom. Let's go ahead and murder some ships. Headmaster series, Japan only one, had a combiner group that was six trains. That must have been released here in the U.S. as a toy, because they did release a bunch of the toys here even after the TV series uh, uh, ended. I think some of that got... Uh, um, Included in like the comics and stuff like that, which I think continued longer. <laughs> Don't recall if the Mar Marvel comic had uh, that group or not. Yeah, I, I I never read the comic myself. What level are we looking at? 168? Yeah, we're not going to get much from these guys for uh, some of our higher level people. Oh, I just wasn't a comic book person. I probably, if I had been a comic book person, I probably would have gotten into it. But I just wasn't a comic book person. Not my thing. Okay, and then Daba, I don't think we're going to be hitting anyone. All right, power launcher. We'll go with that. Hmm. 
I'd forgotten, I, I rewatched the first episode of L game the other day, and uh, I'd forgotten Daba chopped someone's hand off with his laser sword in that. The first episode. It was great. I think the Transformers was the second longest running uh, toy tie-in comic. I'm not surprised. If Marvel had kept the license of Transformers, it would have been in the uh, MCU yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, but yeah, but but if they had, then then it might be the Michael Bay Transformers. We don't want that, right? Okay, no one else is gonna have fortune, so let's go ahead and Fairy's Blessing. Let's go ahead and Sprite's Cheer. I mean, there was no blood or anything. Um, it may have been mechanical. What do you mean you need more for the beam ramp? Okay, you, you shouldn't need the beam ramp, then. Nope, you don't. Alright. Marvel Comic ran all the way through the Headmasters, Power Masters, Micro Masters, and Action Masters lines. Yeah. Yeah, I picked up a few of the uh, Micro Masters sets. I don't know why. It might have been that someone got them for me. I don't know. Six levels there. Hidden bow cannon. All right, take a bow. There were some weird uh, crossovers with Transformers. I know that, or maybe not weird, but unexpected, perhaps. Well, and some of the MicroMasters stuff actually uh, showed up in uh, some of the uh, Brave series as well. And not as MicroMasters, obviously. <laughs> oh, there's a few uh, Gundam ships that do something similar too, and they're pretty cool. Um, Obviously, you have the Argama that uh, um, it slides up and down, um, and uh, I actually I think it was the Reinforce that had a lowering bridge, not the Reinforce Junior, but the uh, the Reinforce. Yeah, not the Reinforce Junior. You can even see the name Die Atlas 2 on the blueprint screen for the men. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, blow you away. So we'll probably... Uh, the White Ark, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right, it does. It's a very weird... That's a very weird one. Um, I think the ship from F-91 might also do that. I'd have to go back and look. Maybe not. No, I'm probably thinking of the Reinforce. Look out, everyone. Multiple large objects inbound. Awogaru, warship fleet! Didn't we take care of these guys already? Invaders. I didn't think we'd see them again after we splattered their bosses across Jupiter. Like the Wolgaru, they crave powerful genes. They want to take us down together so they can split the scraps? Additional machines incoming from the other side at high speed. Uh, hi? When you say high speed, you mean it. 
That's no ordinary Bulgaru. That's a commander unit. A white mobile map mobile weapon means Bulgaru nobility. So everyone, I can't be certain, but I may know who that white unit is. Teoria? N no, no, it's not me. <laughs> Whoa, too close. Personal space, yeah, I know. When I left my world, there was a genetic experiment being grown. A Wolgaru created by combining the genes of the Wolgaru, her nobility. Her name was Dio Luna. Combining noble genes? Yes, including Giarts and my own. I hoped we would neutralize the gate before she was fully grown, but it seems she made it here after all. An experimental subject created from the combined genetics of the Wolgaru nobility, made from genes provided by Galki and Giart, among others. He is extremely capable in combat. He looks down on most Wolgaru and humans both, and is extremely aggressive. He also possesses manners and vocabulary crude enough to make Teoria blush. During the collapse of Heaven's Gate, he saw Giart's defeat at the hands of Red Five, and now sees Red Five as his ultimate prey, his Lamata. Now that is a very odd voice. He showed up in one of the early DLC missions? I don't remember him. It... I may have already passed it by the time it would have triggered and it, it didn't... come in? Oops, uh, let's see, nope. Uh, so this is the planet the beings craving destruction have marked for their prey. This should be fun. How do I return to father after I claim their genes? Maybe I don't have to. I can just amuse myself with these disgusting earthlings until they arrive. She is designed only for combat and her mind is not fully mature. She is dangerous. The Wolgaru nobility gave her command of a fleet? Like the invaders weren't enough of a plant pain. Hey, if their boss wants to come walking right up to us, suits me just fine. We must neutralize Dialuna and end their advance. That's cute. The Earthlings are actually trying. If you really want to play, it's my pleasure to oblige. Alright, defeat all enemies. Dial Luna's uh, mobile weapon. I do find it amusing when they uh, make it, they give it an, a very obviously feminine form. Uh, let's see. Cell Persist, Bullseye Charge, Drive, and Soul, Potential L8, Fighter Spirit L3, Supreme, Morale Plus Bonus, uh, Break Morale Limit L2, Double Action, uh, No Power Parts, uh, Beam Cannon and Claw. All right, so I need some uh, bigger guns on that side, I think. Let's see, Apache gun. Yeah, that'll be a shoot down. There we go. I wouldn't know. I know virtually nothing about Genshin Impact or, uh... I think that's when... Yeah, Genshin Impact. Uh, did you get... No, you did not get that. Alright, let's see. Let's move you up. Let's see, does Shoulder Impact Cannon take you out? Yes, it does! <laughs> Paimon is emergency rations. I thought Makono was emergency rations. Klee is all bombs all the time. Hmm. Also, howdy, Crescents. How's it going?
Let's see, Rail Defender. Yeah, that'll be a shoot down. Her cockpit just looks like it would be really uncomfortable. Like she's riding a bicycle seat and it looks like the, her shoulders are really being pushed down too. Uh, what parts do you have? Nothing that I care about. Uh, is Twin Claymore enough? No. Railgun? Yes. None of the AHSMBs look really ergonomic. Well, we haven't seen too many of the other cockpits like we do for her. There we go, we can take you out. I love how we're using water in space, too. It's neither freezing nor boiling away. How convenient. That'll uh, be a shoot down. Howdy, Prescott. How's it going? It's thanks to magic. That's true. I mean, you're not wrong. What mission are we doing? We are doing the DLC mission for um, the rabbits. Let's see. Can we do Night Caliber end to take one of you out? No. All right. Uh, what do you have spirit-wise? You do have Valor. Is that going to be enough? It is. What about uh, Storm? Yeah. Circular? Yeah. All right. I'm not sure if we've seen all of these. Given you can also use giant Sang Young in space, and that doesn't seem like it should be able to propel itself. Well, that is definitely magic. Eight levels there. All right, let's see if you can get a, a kill as well. No, all right. What about Valor? Is that going to be enough? Yes, it is. Can we go cheaper? Yes, we can. Sure. <laughs> they made Boss Barat space capable in Super Robot Wars, that's true. Howdy, Nadaroge AI, how's it going? So I've seen their new combo attack. Uh, I don't think I have a new combo attack for him. Holy crap, you got a lot of uh, X counter now. I'll go ahead and just use love.
Well, on the upside, Ray Earth is not going to have uh, space squid guts all over her. Actually, that's an, it's not uh, squid because uh, it's more of a nod, um, not a Nautilus. And I'm forgetting which one that is. Hmm. It's a different uh, creature. Chop right through it there. And what parts do you have? Uh, Cell Spirit on all the units? Something to consider. You loved how he was running in space? Yeah, it's always pretty good. Alright, you are level 150, so we do want to get another kill with you. So let's go ahead and do that. Yay, more muting on Twitch. More than a few units do a walk in space trick. That's true, yeah. Zendog is definitely the worst uh, offender in that. Uh, just because of the sound. <laughs> I hate the sound so much. I don't know why I hate it so much. It's just like so grating. Valor. Let's get a blessing and a cheer. There we go. Excellent. All right, we've got nine enemies left, so Circular will take you out, and I don't need to use anything to do so. I want to get him up to uh, 160. Kid's going hard on the coconuts in space to keep the effect going, yeah. over here, so let me come over here. Okay, you only need to uh, take out one more. I like that. To defeat Gridman, I'll fight alongside him. Sure, I'm helping you, but I really hate you. All right, that's going to be a shoot down. All right, that should get you up to uh, level 60. <laughs> Uh, you can just stand by. Just in case. Alright. So we got six left. Uh, let's see. You were level 168. That's okay. Well, uh, you know what? I should use the people who can move. To 
you get good stuff. I Never fear, Big that. Pickle has arrived. Howdy, Hessen. How's it going? Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and auto cannon you. Going all right, trying to cool down after the seven minute drive home in the heat from work. Ooh. Yeah, I know how that is. It, it was your car like sitting out in the sun or something? All right, let's see, you can get up here. Let's come up here and X action, smash hit. I don't think we need direct action. Been clocking at 100 plus after at work this week. Yeah, it's been pretty warm here too. Uh, we did get full ultra burst mode, but I need to uh, do a few things to get that available. I feel like I'm still missing something. I need to be a hero. Look, Azuru, we don't need another hero. We just need to get beyond Thunderdome. Azuru, the enemy's right there. Don't get distracted. Focus was never his strong suit to begin with. Don't try to fool us. You're not the thinking type. So just go for it. Stay out of your own head or I'll put some fire under your tail. Hot pickles are not great. Yeah. Uh, okay, uh, right now all I can do is try. If I keep doing that, I'll be a hero someday. Oh, Tessa from uh, Full Metal Panic? I never liked her. I don't know why. All right, what parts do you have? Proof of bravery. Sure. All right, we got ultra full burst mode. All right, I got a 100% critical. I got... Okay, let's go with soul, actually. All right, that will be a shoot down. All right, so we just need to take out two more. Auto to the rescue. Yeah, I had to go back to the, um, at the start of the pandemic, I had to go uh, get my eyes checked uh, because my glasses broke. <laughs> they just fell apart, actually. Yeah, Full Metal Panic is great. I just, I did not like Tessa at all. I don't know why. There was just something about her that just rubbed me the wrong way. Yep. Yeah, I had to wear my sunglasses at night for a uh, time. Uh, it's more that I just, uh, not knowing why kind of bugged me. Uh, what is your current rate? 20, good. Yeah, 
Okay, he's still at 20. Okay, next up. Okay, you have 19, so... Do you have a cell? No, you don't. Alright, boost dash. There we go. Alright, so everyone has moved who needs to move. We've got one enemy left. Ultra full burst mode. Let's get some fortune and gain. This Wolgaru won't hold still. I can't track her. I've heard of you. You're pretty good for an Earthling. You'd better make this fun. If you do, I'll rip you apart last. Oh, don't worry. He'll rip himself apart for this uh, attack. <laughs> Well, now it's four eyes. Clearly, he was jealous of uh, Uso having the only uh, winged suit. I love that part. Just, it's so ridiculous. <laughs> Launches out a mini uh, mech from inside of it. Hey, <laughs> eh, just stand by. And he gains one whole level out of that. Not bad for a bunch of rats. But if you thought you could stop me, you're fooling yourselves. Damn it, she's trying to get past us. No, she's trying to run away. Used to wear contacts, but eventually stopped wearing them uh, more out of being tired of putting them in and taking them in out every morning night. Yeah. I I don't think that I could put them in. Like, I just have... Uh, uh, uh. She's heading straight for the Godinian. That's because the Godinian followed her. Don't let her reach it. A ship can't possibly evade her. I mean, it could if uh, uh, Bright uses uh, Flash on him. Uh, on it. Intercept the enemy commander. You think you can outwit me? I'll take out your bridge. Zeru. Seriously, you have to stop doing things like this. I I'm a hero. A hero protects... Isuru! Isuru defended the Godinian and... Red 5's Assault Jaeger has been torn apart. The core module has sustained heavy damage as well. Oh. Oh no. What are we going to do without Red 5? Ellie! Ellie, do you want to come over here and use 1% of your power? Recover him on the double. You actually slowed me down. Oh well, once I'm on the surface, the party's back on. Dialuna's unit has broken through and is headed towards Earth. After that unit, alert our allies to intercept her before she enters atmosphere. It's too late. We've lost her. No. The enemies in this force are pulling out. The ones in the surrounding area are still fighting. We've repelled the first wave. Where's Dialuna? We lost her after she got past us. Some of the surrounding forces also appear to be heading for Earth. We can assume they'll rendezvous with Dialuna and enter the atmosphere. We need to regroup. Recall all units. Azuru. I know you're still alive, Azuru. How kind of leader are you if you ditch us when the going gets tough? You total turbo dumbo! D this is what you get for trying to be a hero! Just hang on, buddy. We're coming for you. So please be okay when we get there. 
I'm sure Azuru will be fine. Trace Trigger, briefing room. Captain Suzukaze, how's Azuru? We retrieved him quickly and rushed him to emergency care. He's alive. Sweet! Oh, thank God. But, but he hasn't woken up. He just needed a, he needed a nap, all right? Really? But he will soon, right? We don't know. No, but... Gotta be kidding! Azuru. Like, guys, 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 this is an anime. The protagonist of uh, one of the series has uh, uh, gone into a coma. He'll wake up probably at, like, the last second necessary to uh, make a save. Alright? It's okay. So Azura is going to be out for a few missions? That's not new for him, considering the bug. Exactly! <laughs> the Wagaru have made landfall. Yes, we weren't able to hold them. We tried to track them, but even if we locate them, we still have nothing that can stop Dialuna. Ellie's like, What? I'm not taking a break. Why, why are you ignoring me? There have been some works, yeah. But that's usually at the very end. The one thing we do have is the Wolgaru's likely target. You mean the Glanzir Cosmopolitan Academy? That's right. I'm betting Dialuna has her eye on the genetic samples stored there. Skirmishes with the Wolgaru are still happening in upper orbit. The Hamtopia will take the Dreis Traeger and the Godinian to the far east to engage Dialuna. The operation begins in two hours. Everyone, be prepared. Zuru. Can we even beat her without him? Ellie's like, again. Again, what am I, chopped liver? Daba's like, I'm pretty sure I could take him. Uso's like, eh, I could probably take him too. Priscilla is like, I'm sure I can do it. Maybe even with my butt cannons. Do we have a chance? I, I don't know. Sir, what do we do? <laughs> They're after jeans, right? Yeah, <laughs> Grid Knight is the mission ace. Uh, 532,000 credits, 772,000 uh, XP, 862 PP, total score 31, 4,000 MXP. Other things we have gained as well. We need to protect our Levi's. A new mission is available in Ferrano, a far east region. All right, well, before we do that, let's go ahead and do an upgrade. Um, <laughs> All right, who do we have that might be story based? Well, we haven't finished all of the uh, J Decker stuff, so we can do that. Gold Leo, I am going to need soon, though. Well, not need, but I'll take him out on the uh, Ikaruga mission. Uh, definitely mobility. Alright, so we have an emergency, but before we dive into that, let's go ahead and get a save. And head back to the title screen. ニクトリの運動性にボクとハロの2人分の精神コマンドがあれば、やれるはずだ。待て、嘘。しまった。他のユニットが未行動のままでフェーズ終了してしまった。完全に1人で突っ走ってるわね。ちゃんとそして欲
I'm pretty sure I could just send Ellie out and take care of everything, Oliver and Marbet. Alright, so for those watching on YouTube, we'll be back with the next episode. For those watching on Twitch, don't go anywhere, because we will be right back.